Any good drink, you have fresh fruits in it. So we have oranges in here, some strawberries. And I cut them big, you know, I just use strawberry halves. This is Tipsy Bartender, so we go on in with some vodka, okay? Now what this vodka is gonna do is this gonna fortify my drink, but this vodka is also pulling flavor from those fruits, amen, okay? So this vodka is gonna taste like oranges and strawberries up to this point right here. Is that enough? That's good. We're coming in here with some pineapple juice. This gives us that nice tropical flavor. Okay? Look at that stream. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to be like this 10 years ago. Woo! I was known for my stream. Now we're coming behind that with some orange juice, okay? Minute made, pulp free. If you want pulp in your drink, you could add in the pulpy one. You don't like pulp? If I'm hungry, you know, a spoonful of pulp would be good, but I ain't hungry right now. Guys, one of my favorite mixes now is LaCroix. So let's get our LaCroix in there. Okay, I got big <laughs> I got big hands, but this should work. Oh my God. <laughs> this is it's extremely efficient. Fountain. Okay, look here. It ain't working out the way I thought it would, okay? But you get the point. Oh my gosh, okay, let's stop, let's stop, let's stop. Please, let's stop. Stop what? We just getting started. Oh no. How was that? 50% of the LaCroix got in, and that's what matters. Now you're coming over the top with my boy, Champagne. No, it's good when it's twist off. <laughs> Still a cork though, kind of. Actually, it's a twist off cork if you look at that, okay? I don't know what's going on there. I could pour some of this in, right? But being tipsy bartender, what's the best way to do this? All in. Look at this holding. Okay. And it's holding. I'm very glad that didn't go. It's holding. There. Now trust me, y'all y'all thought, hey, the LaCroix spilled, so this is gonna spill too. That just goes to show you how you don't know drinks. So guys, I need to garnish this glass now. So I'm gonna use the oranges. Notice how thick this is. It's a thick ass garnish, because it's a really big glass. Now you got some spillage, because that garnish has been causing to spill. Because the champagne's still running in, mind you. Know what else I need? I need a strawberry on this bad boy. So I take out a piece of the strawberry, just to make it fit on the glass. You see that? When you have a wide glass, and you need a garnish. Bang, now she sits snug. Come in with two straws, just in case. Bang. <laughs> we'll in there somewhere. And there you have it, the brunch punch. Okay, you ready to party? Try this, drink responsibly, don't drink and dry. Stay tipsy. Okay, if you survived this, you had a great brunch. <laughs>